So after finish the installation, now you can use the software. But before you use this application, you need to finish some initial setup. Now open your application, Visual Studio. Here, the software will ask you to sign in if you have an account. If not, you can do maybe later. We have three options here. It belongs to you. It belongs to your favorite color. In my case, I suggest that we should do the light team and click Star Visual Studio. Wait for in some minutes and your application is ready to use. Now this is the interface of the Visual Studio software. To start your new project, you will click on New Project and a new window will appear. We are discussing about the C, C++ language. So here you will do the C++ here. And in this window, we will choose the empty project. So after you choose the empty project here, you will look at the below. Here we have the name. This is the name of the project. And initially, the program will give the project one. And the location is the place you choose to save your own project here. You can choose the files to change the folder where you will save your project and select that I will do this and in the solution name you will give the name it's the same as the folder you can save many projects in for example in your requirement you will write three projects and you want all of these are saved in the solution name C programming language. So here you type in the solution name C programming language, then click OK button. And the new window appear. On your right hand side, you will right click on the source file and click add and choose new item. And here you will choose the C++ file. And this one you can give the name for your file. And initial, the program will give the name source.cpp. You can make the modify, you can give the new name for your file. Then click add to show the line on your workspace. You can click the tool and choose the option. And here you move to the text editor and click this icon. And you choose the C++, C++ here and click the line number. This step will show the line on your code. It is useful for you to debug your program. Then click OK. Now you can see on the workspace, the line number here. And now you can start your first project using the Visual Studio software. In the next video, I will give you instruction of using output and input function on this application. Thank you for watching.